what's happening exactly there? So we've discovered a swarm of bees on the trees that were brought down, so we're going to go up and see if we can capture it and put it on the new hive. And why would you just not leave the, hive, the swarm where it is? Well, it, it may move and go someplace where you really don't want a swarm of bees to end up, like somebody's roof space or that. It might only be a temporary resting point for them until they would find somewhere more permanent. So we'll try and encourage them now to stay in a hive that we have up there. The suit you're putting on, is that...? Well, it's made a thicker material, so it helps you protect you from getting anything that might normally sting. Okay. And, and bees, can I penetrate that at all, or...? No. Yeah. You can't find it difficult to get through, and they... Really they want, and they're being quite more quiet now, anyway, because they're swarming. So they don't actually want to sting anybody. They're swarming because they're full of honey that they've taken from the hive that they came out of. And they want to that honey because they don't know how long it is before they can find somewhere to stay. So we've sort of stocked up a bit. So we don't like to bend their abdomen that they need to do the sting. So And would you be tempted to wear that at Halloween? Hey? Would you be tempted to wear that suit at Halloween? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. The the Martian. <laughs> That's the swarm. Yes, very gingerly cutting the branch around the swarm so we can try and move it. Come at you there, Duddy. See they all they all hanging beside each other. Oh. Top of each other. I'll just pick them up now. Oh 
Oh, you're going to take the whole thing up? Attack you now, are they? I see they're Aye. on your suit. They're trying to sting you now, I think, are they? Aye. Must be loading them down there. Whilst they leave the cameraman alone. <laughs> huh? Well, they leave me alone. So. There's a load underneath. Oh, shit, do you think they'll find. Huh? Do you think they'll all come under? Well, I'm hoping, but there's a load of them on the ground here, and I'm not sure. I'm going to mess that. Right, I don't want to go too close in case they think I'm responsible for all that. Huh? I don't want to go too close to it. Uh, Try and get them into the box. Okay. They seem to be sticking. Hey? They seem to be sticking to the ground. Do you think is that yeah, because? The ground there, but is that because the queen I'm might not be? Not sure if the queen's on there or not. Okay. You? Well, I'm hoping that they have the queen in there, and they usually they go where the queen goes. Yes. They fall over. So I'm hoping she's on the in there, and they'll take up in that space now, and she'll they'll stay there. You know. Okay. Okay. Good job. And just for curiosity, what what's going on up here? Well, that little that little monitor beehive. Yeah, that's a a new cave oh. and there, it looks very busy at the minute so I haven't checked it yet but there may be uh, a swarm in there as well. And what's its purpose? Well its purpose is to attract because every year the, the, the swarms will split at some point and, and new, new swarms will form so if one leaves the old hive oh. you want it to go somewhere where you want it you know so hopefully it was under your new cave and then you can transfer it into the bigger hive when you're ready. 